Hello, my name is Shannon Ezra and I play Samantha Hugo in Lioness. Interestingly, in preparing for my character, I was watching my octopus teacher and I was incredibly inspired by, I mean, not only the film itself, but the journey of his relationship with this incredible animal and how an octopus is the ultimate survivalist. And that started to really make me think about Sam as a survivor and adaptation. And uh, yeah, so I actually looked quite externally. Um, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a huge animal lover, I adore nature. So again, going to the lion kingdom, going to the big cats, going even just, you know, just watching regular domestic animals and just the way that they are so instinctive. Um, that, that's helped with a lot of my prep for her. Gosh, I, you know, it's always so hard to think what's going to surprise an audience about, about a character. I think, I think her reserve, her absolute reserve and strength and just her, the love for her children and that nothing, nothing can get in the way of that. Um, I mean, I don't know if it's going to be surprising. It was surprising to me because I'm not a mom and I have felt incredibly maternal during this process. And then I'm, I'm, I'm even like starting to do it with like friends. And I'm like, I'm sorry, I don't mean to mother you. Like I'm just in that like mode. So yeah, I don't know, maybe that. I think a character trait that I really admire about her is how she speaks her thoughts. I'm a very filtered person. I try and be very responsive and um, she's just, and she's just so free. She's so free. She doesn't care about what people think of her. Um, yeah, that, that freedom, that sense of like abandon is beautiful. Who is my favorite character? It's definitely Samantha. Ways in which I'm similar to Sam, I think I'm a bit of, I'm a tough cookie and so is she. Um, what ways are we dissimilar? Like I said a little earlier, she speaks every thought that comes to her mind. I do not. Um, she really stands up for herself. And I like to do that better. She is by far the most intense character I have ever played. It's, it's been amazing. What makes her so intense? The story itself, and I can't really speak to it because we don't want to give too much away. Um, but also, what, what's quite intense is is, is the this the shooting process. You know, we're doing so much in so little time, so it's like in, it's incredibly concentrated. But it's it's actually it's it's helping it's helping me because I'm I'm thriving off the energy. I mean, look, don't get me wrong. There are days when I'm like, I'm so tired, but. It's, uh, it's, it's invigorating and very inspiring. I would love if the audience can take away, um, I, think we're I think we're trying to create something very different and I would love if they can really feel that and they can come on this journey. There's just so many beautiful nuances and relationships and dynamics and I would love if they just, I just want them to come on the journey with us. And if, and if they can follow, that would be, if they can just follow us and enjoy it, that would be the best.